So uh, what are the normal financial goals? So most of the time uh, when I go and speak with the people, so I have another customer coming to me. He has sold his company and then uh, he got around a good set of amount around 20 to 36 crores and all this stuff. And I asked a simple question to him, what are your financial goals? So he says, no, I don't have a financial goals at all. So I said, yes, I know that you have a good set of amount. So most of the time when you have a good set of amount, so you may not be wanted uh, these goals because these goals must have achievable, but you should be having some goals. So he says, no, I don't know. You tell me what are the goals. So most of the time when we are talking about financial goals, we take care of a child's education and a marriage, buying an assets, retirement funds and buying a car and a vacation. When we are able to take care of all these things, then the next set of the goals comes where people will start thinking of how to bring the society up, how to give back to the society, how to take care of uh, my appreciation, where I can go to the next generation, how I can give it across. Or if I have any of my uh, businesses or my passion I wanted to do. So a lot of time nowadays, people say I may not be the right person to do the startup. So I wanted to uh, fund a few startups. So this is the, another kind of things which has been happening across where people uh, are asking what are the goals people look across and do it. So when so our first understanding is to make sure that we have a financial goal and we are able to achieve the goals. So because none of us are going to get a pension, none of us are going to get uh, nowadays those days are gone where we have a joint family and our kids and others will take care of us. So that's another very huge amount. So most of the time when we do the retirement planning, we don't take care of inflation linked. This is another thing I have seen last uh, two weeks back. I was having another customer who came back to me and he said, no, I have taken a one pension plan, which is going to give me uh, 30,000 and I spent only 30,000 rupees. Then I said, you are just a 55. He said, yeah. So I said, you are spending 30,000 now and you need to take care of till 85 or 90. Do you think 30,000 is enough? He said, yeah, why not? Because that's what I spent. So sometimes I was trying to explain him and then he says, oh my God, I didn't realize it that I have to take care of inflation. So it's nothing wrong in a, taking a pension plan which can take care of 30 or 40% of your total pension because that is a constant amount. It's not an inflation link. So whenever you are doing any retirement planning, please make sure that whoever it does for you or you do yourself, take care of inflation linked also. 